Hey, what's up guys? This is Dan again with not my 2018 STI for once. This is a little uh, early Christmas present I got for myself. Uh, my wife is very excited to say the least. That is complete sarcasm. If you can't hear in my voice, she is pissed off at me, but rightfully so. I mean, bikes are dangerous. Um, even if you are a good driver, to all the other idiots on the road, as we all know. But nonetheless, I bought this 2008 Ninja. It is a 250, uh, but that's fine because it's my first bike. It's a uh, learner's bike and um, I love it. And I feel like it's adequate power for especially around here. Um, I got my STI over there, same color. So that worked out. And um, yeah, I didn't need something fast. I didn't need something to uh, commute with. This is just a toy to have fun with, to drive on the weekends, to hit the back roads with, and uh, it's a lot of fun, a lot of fun. I've had it for a week. I got my um, permit and um, registration, all the documentation, and I'm working on my license. So I can ride it with somebody, and I have ridden it a good amount, and um, I could say that although people hear 250 and, and scoff sometimes, that it is, um, adequate power if you live in a place with a good amount of traffic like Long Island or if you just don't want to kill yourself I mean the bike only weighs 330 pounds so even if it has 30 horsepower or a little more that it gets up and goes I mean power is just it's it's horsepower to weight it's a ratio and since it's light it doesn't need a lot of power so I, you know, I did a lot of research. I've been looking online and uh, I knew I wanted a bike for a while. Uh, I really didn't care what it was. I would have driven a Harley. I would have driven an Indian. I don't care if it was a crotch rocket, obviously, but um, it was really about uh, the price and the mileage and the condition. So um, I was doing a lot of research. I was looking around and I was always looking at Facebook Marketplace and eventually this bad boy popped up. Um, on Facebook Marketplace, um, a guy was selling it. He was the second owner. Um, like I said, 2008, it's got 2,000 miles. And uh, the bike was very clean. Of course, I cleaned it up. I'm into detailing, if you've seen my other videos. So I polished the whole bike. I went through and through, did oil change, cleaned the filter, spark plugs, um, Berryman's um, chem tool in the gas tank, which definitely seemed to stabilize the idle. That's some pretty serious stuff. Um, and clean the carbs. This is a carbureted bike. Um, so besides basic maintenance, the only thing I did was put this Yoshi Moore exhaust on. This thing sounds absolutely beastly. I mean, prior to this, it sounded okay, but kind of like a lawnmower. It's a small engine, so it's kind of expected. But this thing, oh man, you get what you pay for with this exhaust. This thing turns a small bike engine into a complete monster and it's good because people hear you coming and it just it makes it more fun to ride i mean when you're downshifting the thing's just you know backfiring and popping and screaming it's just absolutely awesome matches the bike absolutely love it so besides that i haven't really done anything i really don't plan on doing anything um like i said it's my first bike it's a learner's bike i will enjoy it and um if I feel the need to flip it, I'll flip it. Maybe I'll get a bigger bike. But like I said, I've been seeing a lot of other reviews in the past. And they're all older reviews. People give very basic overviews. But the consensus is the same. And it's that it's a great bike. It's especially a great beginner's bike. And it's fun. It's easy to handle. And it is light. And um, it's easy to maneuver. And if you're getting into bikes, um, it's easy to control. I've ridden a bike a couple times in the past <clears throat> but um i've never actually went around and like really got on it so i learned quick with this thing it did not take long and um once i got my permit i was able to cruise around and i feel comfortable on it it's only been like i said a week and uh just the nature of the bike makes you feel very comfortable as a rider <clears throat> Let me start it up for you guys real quick. So like I said, just over 2,000 miles now, which is low for a bike. Typically bike mileage is 
rated higher than car mileage so like 20,000 miles on a car is really nothing but 20,000 miles on a bike is considered a semi high amount but either way this is low so that was that definitely attracted me um, hang on I don't think we're in neutral here okay it's in neutral so I don't have to clutch in on this I could just start it up
recommend it as a daily driver. I would never have just a bike as a daily driver. That's why I have the STI. But, um, you know, I don't need power. I'm married. I don't want to kill myself before I have kids. <laughs> I want to play it safe. So, uh, this is this is good enough for now to cruise around on the weekends and on the back roads. So, if you have any questions, let me know.